Hi, Jamie here. Today I'm going to tell you my secret to fly control in the summer with my horses. Now Stella here, she gets flies, those little tiny house flies, she gets them matted on her back and her, her barrel. I've tried so many different kind of fly sprays, I'm sure you have too. This is not the fly spray, this is just the container I'm using. I used to like this, I liked the shine that it gave, but uh, a couple of my horses got a bad allergic reaction, so I don't use it anymore. But what I found was since I have a couple horses that are really sensitive to fly spray, I need to find something more natural, but you know how natural it is, it doesn't, you know, it's not that strong, so come on, babe. Anyways, this is what I found was white vinegar. Just white vinegar. I have white vinegar in here, and then I have just mentholatum. Just campophonique is what I call it. But I guess it's mentholatum. And all I do, and Stella, she ain't too bad because she has some on still. But you can see some flies on her. But I mean, she gets matted like right here, and underneath her stomach, and right here. She just gets matted. So all I do with my white vinegar is I do a quick spray. And then I, when I do a quick spray, I take the mentholatum. And all I'm going to do is do dots on the, the problem areas. Like I'll do a dot right there. And then uh, I'll do a dot right here. Just any of the bad areas, I do right underneath her stomach. That's a really bad one for her. And then I'll do right there and on the other side. And I'd probably do one by her tail. And I'd probably do one, you know, back, her back barrel. She don't get them bad on her legs too bad. But I just, that's what I do. I just spray with the white vinegar and, and just do dabs on the really bad areas. and you will be surprised how well that works. I didn't think it would work because, you know, home remedies are usually not you know, very strong. But this is what I found and maybe it'll work for you too. Thank you, bye bye.